I went to see a sneak peek of The Lion King live action, and here is my movie review. Y'all know what time it is. It's time to hit that subscribe button. It's time to hit that subscribe button down there. It's time to follow me on my Instagram, Geekly Amanda, G-E-E-K-L-Y Amanda. Same on Twitter. And it's movie review time. Movie review time. Who's ready to hear about The Lion King? So yesterday I went to see the sneak peek of the new live action, The Lion King. Let's start off with the casting in the movie. So I'm going to tell you, I enjoyed the casting. I loved it. They had Donald Glover as Simba, you know, Beyonce as Naya in this. And um, I'm a, you know, they had Seth Rogen. Seth Rogen was playing with, with the, the warthog. You know, what's what's his name? Um, T Timon Pumbaa. Pumbaa. The warthog Pumbaa. I'm going to tell you, I love the casting in this. I thought it was perfectly casted. I thought they were great in their roles. Believable. Um, the only problem I did have with the casting is with the action, the music. They had the cast sing a lot of the songs. Some of them were great. Some of them not so great. I love Beyonce. I love her voice. But her paired with Donald Glover singing Can You Feel the Love Tonight still didn't work for me. It still didn't work for me. I first heard it a little trailer clip they had played. And they only played like 20 seconds of it. And I didn't like it then. I was hoping when I went to see this movie that it was done a little better. It was Donald Glover, who's not really, you know, a, a, a singer, paired with Beyonce, who's a great singer. So she, he's trying to go up to her level and she's trying to take it down to his. And it just didn't match, especially when you think of the original and Elton John singing the Timon original. and Pumbaa. The, them two together singing. You know, Hakuna Matata. The pair itself is funny. Seth wrote those two in the part. Who is it? Seth Rogen and Billy. Seth Rogen and Billy Etchner together. It's, you know, that they were perfect in that role. They were perfect in the role. It, they won the movie for Some me. Some of the little Easter eggs was singing Be My, Be, Be My Guest in there brought tears of laughter. Other tears was tears of just emotion. I love how they stuck to the original story pretty much. I love how they did that. I loved a lot of the song. Like I said, I loved a lot of the song. Visually, this movie was stunning. It was beautiful. The scenery was beautiful. And the CGI, all of the all of the animals were CGI, you know, created. Using CGI, they can bring the emotions in the animals alive within like their facial features, their facial expressions. That didn't bother me. It reminded me a lot of the Jungle Book and how they brought those animals to life and that and had them speaking and things. That's what this reminded me of. I, I enjoyed it. I liked it. I had fun with them. My daughter who was 11 was attended it with me. And we were, when it was over, we looked at each other. We said we loved it. We wanted, we can't wait to see it again. Enjoyable. You know, a great movie for kids. I mean, you're gonna deal with the the death scenes, the those hard scenes, a little scary. They have scar, but I mean, if they've seen the original, you're not too surprised. Voice of Mufasa. Hello, who can get better, James Earl Jones? James Earl Jones does Mufasa. I can't think of anyone who can who would be any better in the role. <laughs> you know, James Earl Jones as Mufasa in, in India trailer, who Mufasa was played by Shara Khan. I kind of want to see it in there because I want to see how Shara Khan also does in the role because James Earl Jones has the voice, did it great, but I can totally see him in the Mufasa role. So now I want to, I want to see it again here. I want to see it again. <laughs> I want to, I want to see it, you know, with the Indian dub version. I enjoyed it that much. I enjoyed the movie that much. I give it a rating out of four out of five. I think it's a great movie to family movie to bring the kids. So that's my movie review. Let me know what you think when you see it. Comments, thumbs. Don't forget to subscribe. Till next time. Bye, y'all.